Welcome to Sandwiches of History and the very last International Sandwich Sunday of 2023. Okay, so you can tell I am still on the road. I'm not in my kitchen at home in San Jose. Uh, so today I went with a sandwich that's relatively easy to make. It's a Chilean sandwich called the Barros Harpa. Now the Barros Harpa is a derivative of the Barros Luco, which I did a while back. That was named for a Chilean president named uh, Ramon Barros Luco, uh, and he used to order it and it had steak and it has cheese. Well, it turns out his cousin Ernesto Barros Harpa uh, was a minister in the government and he liked that sandwich, except for he found that the steak was a little bit tough to chew. Uh, so he asked for one that has ham in it instead. And that's the one we're gonna be making today. So there weren't a lot of recipe resources online, so I'm just gonna do it the way I think it should be done. Hopefully I don't offend you, Chili. Um, ham steak in a pan. Let's get it some color on it. All right, we got some color on one side, flipped it over. Now, normally it uses a cheese called Monte Coso. Um, I don't have that, I don't have access to that, but it's got Monte in it, which Monte Kio is butter. So we go for a buttery cheese. It was recommended to use Port Salut cheese. So that's what I'll do. And then we throw in some bread, buttered side down to get that crisped up. Have a little bit of water and cover it. Yeah, it's basically a ham and cheese sandwich, but I should mention that it dates back to the 1800s. So let's give this Barros Harpa a go. Smoky ham, buttery melty cheese, toasted bread and butter. So delicious. I do want to plus it up though. Well, I was going to add an over easy egg until I broke the yolk, but look, a heart. Love that. I'm also going to add a touch of this green jalapeno paste for a little heat. Okay, let's give this Barros Harpa plussed up with an egg and some jalapeno paste. Look, ooh. Mm. Now that's a breakfast sandwich. <laughs> Were I at home, I probably would have made some sort of a Chilean condiment to go with it, but I'm on the road, it's a busy time of year, uh, so went with the green jalapeno paste that I picked up at the store the other day. Um, the original Barros Harpa, delicious. Buttery cheese, smoky ham. It's a grilled ham and cheese sandwich, and it is delicious. I'm gonna give that an eight and a half, just because I love that combination. Plus up with the egg and the jalapeno paste, that's easily a nine and a half, almost 10. That is just delicious. Uh, definitely gonna finish that. And I would make this again in a hot minute. <laughs> All right, see you tomorrow. Oh.